Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernard from the BTNHT, and yes, how to enable the hidden dark mode within Windows 10. Uh, yeah, <laughs> uh, I believe, uh, I'm trying to remember which Mac version, uh, I think it was Yosemite that had this dark mode that changes the entire interface uh, to help reduce the the light when you're using your computer during the night and it looks like uh, Windows 10 has this mode but it's not an option for us to use off the bat so there is a, a registry key that you need to enable two of them uh, one is in the local hive and another one is in the user hide which I'm going to show you guys and I'm going to post this information at my site the link is going to be that bottom of the description so click on it so you get the registry stuff so let's get started so first thing that you need to do is uh, Windows R uh, type in reg edit hit OK you're gonna get the nice user account control just hit yes on that and we need to get into the H key local machine uh, we need to go inside software Microsoft Windows so I'm gonna, I'm gonna double click on this to expand it there it goes we need to get into in the Windows node go all the way to the bottom Windows current version and we want to get into this within the win current version there is a themes expand that and within themes uh, there is no there's supposed to be a personalized folder so what you guys want to do is right click you want to go to new and you want to create a new key now within this key you want to go is personalize so let's go personalize make sure you spell it right uh, P E R S O N A L I Z E yes awesome and within here we want to right click in here we want to create a new D word 32 bit and that's gonna actually be called apps uh, use light theme yep and the value is going to be zero cool zero turns it on one turns it back off okay so we're gonna leave that on so make sure it's spelled right apps use light theme I'm looking at my notes right here awesome and the next one that we need to do is we need to go inside our current user so I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna click on that I'm going to go to uh, let's go into current user within current users you want to go to software within software we want to go to Microsoft go all the way to the bottom we want to go to Windows within Windows we want to go into current version and within current version I believe we need to get into the themes folder again there it goes expand that there is a personalized folder in here so what we want to need to do is right click go to new we create a new D word and the D word is going to be apps which is the same thing that we did last time on the local machine hive and it's going to be apps use light theme hit enter hit enter again to open it up and the value is zero again zero turns it on uh, if you go back into this hive it will turn it uh, it would turn it off it put one so what I'm gonna do is press OK here and I'm actually gonna right click on this actually I'm not gonna right click I'm gonna click on that and I'm gonna to go to file uh, edit let's go to edit where is it 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 export I'm gonna export this right here I'm gonna export it to the desktop and it's gonna be dark theme and the reason why I am going to this is two because it's the second place and the reason why I'm exporting it is because I'm gonna be putting this at my site so if you guys want it you could grab it hit save and let's go into the next last one the last one was inside local machines and where are you where are you where are you there it goes personalize is the one that we need file export and we're gonna call this dark one okay and I'm saving those two files now once you make those two modifications within your reg you can either log off or restart your machine all right and we are all right and we are back so the way that we know that everything is done so let's click on start let's go to settings and the settings dialog box should be black completely black how awesome is this so yeah so the dark theme did go through let's go to fire explorer and see if fire explorer it doesn't look like fire explorer has changed 
but it looks like there's certain things that uh oh look see the dark dark theme looks like it uh, it hit again i'm using build 10162 so i'm wondering if the theme the dark theme will look a little different from the latest builds i'm trying to update this machine to see if that happens other than that guys that is how you uh bring up the dark theme within windows 10 i want you guys to try it out with your build to see if it works out again i'm gonna place all the information at the bottom of the description the link is gonna go directly to my site grab the stuff again i have the information right here so most likely all you guys gotta do is just download these files double click and it will create the stuff for you and uh that's it guys hopefully you guys enjoy leave comments right below it does support the video as well as this guy and i catch you guys on the next one peace out